Hey guys, so I almost lost my hair and I did lose some hair on my freaking arms. Like my arms are hairy and I like to not shave them. So I know I lost hair from my arms, from my fingers. Like I'm gonna show you guys. I freaking tried out a new shampoo and I didn't think nothing was gonna happen to me. Like I thought I was good. So I lathered it for like four times four times and I was lathering it like this when I got home I was showering and I freaking lost my freaking hair from that finger the this finger and I'm gonna show you guys after like what the how are they selling this and I freaking got scared like I literally washed it off so fast when I found out about the reddit reviews that people's hair was like melting off and stuff like that but that's just them but this is just my freaking experience that I'm talking about like I'm literally kind of traumatized at this point so after I got done showering I started coughing and my eye was watery and it just felt like when you get like soap in your eyes and that's how I felt in the shower after I was showering with it and I'm like oh maybe I did get soap in my eye and so I was washing it off but I still felt the same way after I showered and so then I got to my room I was about to put on my clothes and I started coughing and you know what? I'm like, you know what? This is an allergic reaction. So I got some Benadryl. I took it ASAP. Like, I already know what an allergic reaction from a product feels like. So yeah, I got an allergic reaction. And then my sister started looking at reviews. Like, you know what? Um, people are saying that their hair fell out and that there's lawsuits against this brand. And I'm like, oh shit. Like, I better, I better wash this off ASAP. So... I wash it off. I put some bar soap on it. Like I, I was waiting for my sister to go get some Garnier because that's what we usually use. So yeah, I ended up washing it all off. But when I was freaking showering it off, like I noticed on my fingers, like my hair literally came off. Like it knocked down my hair from my arms. And literally, we went to Target earlier, so I know what my hairs look like because sometimes I look at them. Like don't ask me why. Sometimes I look at my arms hair arm hairs or whatever and i'm like oh okay i like them hairy who cares so i'm gonna show you guys how much hair it knocked down like from, from my freaking uh, from my fingers like what the heck this is crazy i could only imagine what would happen if i left it on my hair like as soon as i knew about the reviews and all that i'm like hell no i'm fucking washing this shit off like i'm there i'm washing this shit off but yeah like it's crazy I'm literally so freaking like nervous to even show you guys because how is this even like selling right now? Like how are you guys selling it like that if you know it's like people's hair are falling off? So that's how hairy this freaking finger was. And look at this. It knocked down all of my freaking hairs right here. And my other freaking arm, the same thing. Look at that. My This finger was as hairy as that one. And yeah, guys, I like to be hairy. Don't ask me why, but and yeah whoever hates on it like whatever anyways but that's how i know that it did freaking knock out my hair like what the hell? what the hell like that's crazy and i am gonna tell you guys the brand because you guys need to be careful with the I almost lost my hair like so this is the brand of shampoo that i use guys the monday moisture hyaluronic acid for dry hair and dull hair shampoo and this is crazy because it has five stars on TikTok and it has good reviews. So I didn't really expect it like to happen like this. Like this is crazy. So just be careful when you use this shampoo if you guys are going to buy it. Like I'm not trying to bash the brand or anything. Like this is just based off of my experience and what I've seen that happened to my finger hair. So this is going straight back to the freaking store because what the hell. And yeah, guys.